Hello, hello! We are looking now at another little puzzle. Right to move and save this game from not losing. In other words, get a draw here by doing the right thing. So we do what we do. You pause the video, you see if we can find it for white, and I will show you the solution when you come back. All right, here we are. I'm going to do this. I'm going to show you first the quick, uh, the quick wrong answer, which is uh, knight g2 check, because back can just take, and then play king g4. Since this square is uh, locked for the king, for white's king, he has to go down, and black will get the opposition here like this, and then promote and win. So. It's not uh, knight g2. The the other wrong answer, which has a very, very long line, uh, is king g1, which is wrong also. I will show you this line afterwards, but first I show you the solution if you don't want to see all of this. All right, so the solution to the problem is knight c2. Of course, threatening to uh, take on e3 forces black to move on to e2. And now, what does white do? Well, here it comes. We don't go back to e1. Instead, we attack the pawn with knight d4. Again, threatening to, uh, to take. And of course, black cannot allow that. So he has to promote. Promotes to a queen. Well, looks good for black, doesn't it? But here comes the check with the fork. Wait a minute, the knight is hanging. Well, it, it is, but if black takes it, it's a stalemate. This is stalemate and it's a draw. And if white, if black doesn't take it, of course, we take the, the queen and it's, it's a win. And of course, black can promote to a knight instead knight and uh, bishop could be winning but black will lose his bishop right away so it's definitely definitely a draw all right so that was the solution to the problem and uh, it is really really beautiful but i show you i owe you this explanation also if you want to continue watching i will tell you why king g1 is wrong because black will play king g3 we try to move closer to uh, the pawn. Black gives a check on b5. We have to go back. And the pawn is pushed. All right. So now we cannot come closer with our king. Has to defend with our knight. And if black plays this right, he will win. So knight g2 or c2 doesn't really matter. Uh, black plays bishop to c6, and the uh, knight has to go back. And then black has this great move. Knight, uh, I mean bishop e4, really fencing the knight in. So, looks like an easy win now, but white can still struggle a lot, because he can play knight g2 anyway. Black takes here, it's a stalemate, and it's uh, a draw. So... Black cannot take. Instead, it goes with the king to f3. If now white plays the knight back, well, king goes to e3, and the knight will be taken next move, or the king goes to d2. But white has still some good defense, actually. It can play king h1. Black plays king to f2, and threatening and pinning also the knight and have this uh, as a promotion threat but white plays king h2 and still black cannot take because of the same mate but the point here is uh, that the bishop can also always do some tempo moves but he cannot move in this diagonal let's say you put it here well then it's a draw still because then White can play knight f4, threatening to take here, 
or forcing black to promote and the fork will lose the queen yes he can promote to a knight and still keeps his uh, bishop but a uh, knight against knight and bishop is is really defending so it will be a draw for sure so black has to move in this diagonal oh not like that i mean like this and just get a tempo move so let's go to perhaps g6 uh white king moves back and it doesn't move back to e4 instead it goes to let's say f5 the king goes back and now black can come here white cannot move here he will lose the knight and if he moves the king anywhere black will take with a check and then promote so that's how black wins this it's a it's a sideline but it's it's beautiful and it's important of course to show why king g1 is not saving a draw it has to be knight c2 all right that's all folks please uh, press like on the video to help me grow my channel and of course subscribe if you're not already see you later everybody bye bye